back. Um, busy weekend, uh, but we're going to get a shave in today for you guys, and it's going to be a bad blade shave. So, um, first, we're still continuing the ABC theme over at the Cadre. We are down to the letter U. So, I'm using Uncle John's Gravity. So, haven't used this soap in a while, but I got the matching aftershave splash too, so we're going to see how that goes today. I got a uh, synthetic brush soaking, and let's jump into the blade. Today we are going to be using a carbon blade. It's Teflon coated. It's the Treat DuraSharp. So I'll open this up. They are double wrapped. Treat made in Pakistan on one side, treat Dura Sharp on the other. Get this loaded up into my timeless. We should be good to go. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and pause you guys, build my lather, and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. So let's go ahead and jump into this. This is the Treat DuraSharp. Treat comes from Pakistan. We've done a couple Treat blades before. The reviews on this one are usually that it's extremely mild, but people do tend to like it. The problem is, is it is that carbon blade. Now it is Teflon coated, which I believe is new. That's interesting. So I've used some Teflon coated um, regular blades, stainless steel ones, and I've liked those a lot. It's definitely a more mild blade. But it is doing pretty dang good, comfort-wise. Tiny, tiny bit of tugging as you get down to the lower neck, where my, right around here, starts changing the direction that it grows. Ever slight tugging there. Sharper blades. Don't usually have a problem there for me. First pass was actually pretty good. Um, the big thing with these blades, and we've discussed this in the past, is, is that you need to make sure that you really dry them out so that way they don't um, rust on you early. Looks like I did get a small nick there. I don't know. It was good. Good first pass. I'm going to pause you guys real quick. Okay, so I added a little bit of water to hopefully increase the slickness a tiny bit to see if that helps a little bit. Um, the first pass wasn't as close as I would have liked. Um, I was feeling around. But anyways, I don't back to that. Make sure if you use these carbon blades, you dry them real good. And honestly, I would never recommend them to somebody who lives in a very humid climate. Unless they have their air conditioned to get the humidity nice and low. Here in the state of Utah where I live, our humidity barely ever goes above 30 unless a storm has moved in. But even that short-lived... Most of the time, I believe these blades just aren't worth the hassle. But I do think it would be neat if I found one that was 
comforting, but I honestly, I don't think this is going to be it. Going against the grain now, after already doing one pass, I'm still feeling some minor tugging. Not crazy about it. And also, to be honest with you, it's not sold in a lot of places, this one. Um, the other, their other carbon blades are sold in more places, but Amazon Maggards and West Coast Shaving, all three don't carry this. Amazon had a listing for like a uh, 10-pack, but it was out of stock. Um, Italian Barber, though, you can get a 100-pack for $13.99, so 14 cents a blade. Which is middle of the road for a blade. For the same. Yeah, honestly, not crazy about these blades. I'm not going to do a cleanup or a third pass on them. Just going to go ahead and call it good. Um, pause, you guys. Uh, rinse, clean up, and we'll do post shave in just a second. So, yeah, that, that blade left a lot to be desired. Nothing overly special. I mean, I'm, I'm somewhat close on the cheeks and stuff, but I would have to call that DFS across the board. It's not... No BBS or anything along those lines or, you know, BBS on the cheeks or nothing. I mean, it's it wasn't that great of a shave. I'm hoping tomorrow when I put it in a um, slightly more aggressive razor, it'll do better. Sometimes mild blades do better in more aggressive blades, so we'll try that out and see how that goes. I'm um, hoping to get one more video for you guys this week, but no promises. So, um, it is a short week for me at work. We are going to be going out of town for a family reunion this weekend. So just a three hour drive up north, nothing too bad. But we'll be there for the long weekend. I love the gravity sent by Uncle John's and I would highly recommend it if you haven't tried out his stuff to go ahead and give it a go. It's actually pretty good stuff. And he's been around for quite a while. I mean on all of his labels he's saying since 2011. So it's quite a while. Been doing a good job with his progress. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that shade. A little bit of a shorter video today. Um, so I hope you all have a wonderful week. And hit us up at www.theshavingcadre.com. See you guys on the pages. Have a good day, guys.